If you are one of those Mac enthusiasts who keep waiting for a new one to arrive and the moment it hits the market replaces the older device at home, you aren't getting Mac Pro this year. You can now think of bringing home a Mac Pro or wait till next year. Apple told TechCrunch that it would be releasing Mac Pro sometime in 2019. Tom Bogert, Apple Mac Hardware Product Marketing Senior Director confirmed the postponement to TechCrunch, it's not something for this year. He also mentioned that the product can see the light next year. We want to be transparent and communicate openly with our Pro community so we want them to know that the Mac Pro is a 2019 product. Interesting to know that one cannot really blame Apple for the delay as it never really promised the release in 2018. Way back in 2017, the company very carefully announced to the media that they were looking for something soon without mentioning any particular year or date. Their clever announcement only said that they want to do something great. That will take longer than this year to do. And as the statement said that it would be more than the year which was 2017 then people believe that the device will be available in 2018. As the company told to TechCrunch and as it published in its report, the entire team is working completely at another level in the development of new Mac Pro. Overall, the report was to bring to people what Apple actually wanted to convey. Apple's aim was to intimate its customers that they are developing Mac Pro in the most special way by keeping in mind what they call user workflows. The development of this upcoming product is basically a unique kind of confluence of software and hardware division. Through the report, Apple let the world know how the company is working at magnificent developmental levels in the creation of their upcoming product. It has an entirely new division for its making with the development team and Pro Workflow team both reporting to John Kermuse, the vice president of Apple's hardware engineering. The team is clear about its aim which is to make software development and hardware engineering go hand in hand. This is to make the most of the unique collaboration leading to best support for development and desiring process as well as for checking whether or not all the functions are getting well along. Both the teams are working from just the door away in most innovative manner. More innovative and interesting part is that the Pro Workflow team is also meeting Apple customers and users to give them a thorough idea about how their devices work and what exactly is done in their making. The company is also showing interest in hiring from among its customers both on contract and full-time. To put it simply, Apple is working at an entirely new level and taking all possible care in the creation of their upcoming Mac Pro. The successor of Mac Pro 2013 seems to be steps ahead of the last version and offer most futuristic technology based on better intuitiveness and practicability. All we need to do now is to wait until 2019 to see it finally arrive.